Good morning, brothers and sisters that watch me on this channel, uh, the Messianic Watchmen channel. Um, I want to share with you an experience that I had several years ago um, when I came to live here to Texas. Um, I came by myself, being a practically a single mom, um, before I met my husband now and got married to my husband, uh, I met this Mexican guy and we, after a while we lived together, we moved together and uh, yes, we were living together. We never married, but we lived together and um, yes, I was living in sin because I was in fornication, adultery, um, but I repented from all of those sins and um, God is so good and so merciful that if you repent and turn away from your sins, He will forgive you and He will cleanse you with uh, the blood of His Son, Yeshua. Uh, but back to my experience. Guys, even though I was... I was... Um, I strayed for a little while from the path. Um, I still had fear of God and I would still go to church. By then, I was attending a Baptist church in um, Arlington, Texas, where I used to live. <clears throat> and um, you know that passage in the Bible that says, I was sleeping while my spirit was watching? I had an experience like that. Uh, well, actually two, but I'm going to tell you now of just one the other one i'll have to probably do another video for that one because i don't want this video to be long it's um i pretty much have to leave pretty soon um to go to work but what i'm trying to say is that i was in bed you know sleeping with uh, my then boyfriend slash husband even though i was not married to him and i can't remember what i had i don't know if i was dreaming or i had a nightmare Probably a nightmare. And you know that you can be spiritually attack, attacked um, in dreams. Because it's like sometimes dreams are just dreams. Sometimes God talk through dreams. And sometimes you have a spiritual battle in dreams. And it's really happening even though you think you're dreaming. Um, apparently I had some sort of spiritual struggle or battle in my dream. I can't remember now. It's been several years ago. Um, probably like more, maybe 10 years ago and um, I remember that I woke up um, I woke up but when I woke up I found when I opened my eyes I found myself sitting on the bed and speaking in tongues like I was rebuking something in tongues and you know God give us the gift of tongues uh, to pray in the spirit when we can't find earthly words to pray to the Father the Holy Spirit is there to assist us and you know some people have that that gift and uh, Yes, I have the gift of uh, Praying in tongues or singing with tongues and that's another experience that I can talk to you about in another video how I received the the gift of praying in tongues uh, but yes, I found myself sitting on the bed like rebuking something but speaking in tongues. And of course, my boyfriend slash husband, whatever, uh, my sentimental companion by then, he, he was really Catholic, so he didn't understand what was going on and he was scared. But uh, yes, that happened to me and... You know, I'm just trying to tell you when you go to sleep, pray to God the Father in the name of Yeshua and ask His Holy Spirit to invade your dreams, to be there with you, to not depart from you, to do the fighting with you because sometimes we are attacked spiritually through dreams or in dreams. And the only way to fight these things is to be filled with the Holy Spirit. So even then, when I was still living in sin, I would still fear God, I would still pray, and I would still read the Bible, even though I was aware of my sinful nature and situation. But God is so loving and so merciful that even when I was living in sin, He would still keep an eye on me and protect me, and that's how I see it. 
Um, well guys, that's it from my experience. In later videos, I will tell you about my other spiritual attack or fight or war in a dream. And um, in another video, <laughs> I will tell you about how I received the gift of tongues. So until then, uh, God bless you and have a wonderful day. Bye.